what's up guys welcome back to a brand new episode of vortex right so today i have something that you will be waiting to see this is particular a two stroke model engine so today we are going to learn how does this model works and why two stroke is powerful than four stroke engine so let's get started so guys we should start with the name of parts so basically your two stroke engine is far easier than the four stroke why you can see in the four stroke engine you have valves and some different assemblies for operation of valves for here in the two stroke engine you only have ports so on the head side you can see the top is cylinder head that only consists of a accommodation for a spark plug okay and you know spark plug is actuated by your ignition system right given your engine so now this is your piston that is your cylinder uh, these are your cooling fins in case uh, you know that motorcycle engine single cylinder engines are mostly air cooled so these fins are for air cooling this is your carburetor all right intake manifold the exhaust manifold and this is your transfer port so there are technically three ports in this engine intake transfer and exhaust port now how do this engine works so listen carefully that when uh, now you see for example your air fuel mixture has uh, is inside this cylinder so when your engine moves what happens the piston moves up now thereby it has closed your ports you see now the piston is in front of your post uh, these ports so your air fuel mixture right here will be compressed so as far as your engine moves up more and more the air fuel mixture compresses to this squish volume or you can say your combustion chamber right at the top the spark plug delivers a spark and fires the air fuel mixture as a result your piston rapidly moves down all right up to this stage when pistons ag piston again arrives here what happens the your again this uh, transfer port has opened and at the same time your exhaust port is also open so what happens your exhaust gases flow out by the help of your intake air fuel mixture because your air fuel mixture is cold in temperature and it has a high density so your it helps to push out the exhaust gases through the uh, exhaust port you know that exhaust gases have a high temperature so definitely they have uh, high uh, low air density all right so low density is always pushed by a high density air flow mixture so now uh, you'll be wondering that how uh, air fuel charge gets inside the engine this was the transfer port and this is the intake port now again if you see when the piston moves up okay as you can see this blue color volume increases what happens uh, the volume is increasing it makes a vacuum over here all right when the piston arrives at this part you see the port is open that vacuum is filled by the air fuel mixture coming through the carburetor and this is how your crankcase fills up with air fuel mixture now you can see it is also connected with transfer port as your piston moves down again it shuts off the carburetor passage or intake manifold passage all right and from here when the piston is at this position your air fuel charge right here will be transferred to the cylinder and this is how your cycle keeps on working and your engine runs so now the question is why your two stroke is powerful than four stroke Basically, two stroke is 1.6 to 1.7 times powerful. It's because that you can see every time your piston moves up, it is fully charged with your air fuel mixture. As it goes on the top, it receives a spark and it has a power stroke. So it means that at every cycle or every 360 degree, a two stroke engine gets a power stroke. Okay, whereas in the four stroke uh, engine you know that it has four operations definitely this has four operation but why four stroke because it receives only a one power stroke in every 720 degrees mean two revolutions after every almost two revolution it gets a power stroke whereas at every 360 degree or every single revolution your two stroke engine gets a power stroke so you can therefore see in the motion okay so guys the name two stroke is just like this is again an ic engine okay so this means it has four operation but it covers two operation in just one stroke length like when moving from bottom to top you see it starts compression 
okay and here you can see the port is open intake so in this from down to up it performs two operation like you can see again compression as well as intake but when it moves from top to bottom this is power stroke and at the end you see this is exhaust stroke okay so each stroke consists of two operations that's all guys about two stroke engine i hope you did like and you understand how this thing works so share this video as much as possible because you know knowledge sharing is the best thing in the world and thank you that uh, you like my video recently i uploaded about the four stroke engine so if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and suggest me more videos about the motorcycles or same like uh, educational content so in the end take care stay safe thank you Thank you.